These days, most of what we see online with cops isn't exactly the nicest ones. But now and then, their cameras capture some moments that put our faith back in them. Here are a few instances caught on tape that prove there is still goodness out there. No, no, I'm gonna chill out. Like, All right, let's go. Gosh dang it. Here is a heartwarming story with an interesting twist. Cops are called to the house due to a series of noise complaints. When they arrive, the woman living there steps out. ready for whatever's coming her way. Instead, she takes the chance to offer them something unexpected, food. Now that is a scene you don't get to see every day. Next, we have this police officer who was trying to clear everyone out after a car meet wrapped up. <laughs> but no one could have expected the humor he brought with him. What is he doing in a cop's uniform? He should be doing stand-up comedy instead. Here's another hilarious story that's shown to bring a smile on your face. What did you order? <laughs> One day, a police officer was placing an order at a drive-thru when another officer happened to be nearby. The friendship they share with each other is truly beautiful. We've all heard the jokes about cops and donuts, right? Hello, how are you? Good, how are you? Oh, Jesus! The craziest thing you're not gonna believe. What happened? Are you like a hairstylist? No. So there's like hair hanging out of your tongue? Well, here is a story that takes the stereotype and turns it into something unexpectedly sweet. How adorable is that? Oh my Jesus! Someone's like, Oh, that's my weed! Oh, hold on, that's my wig, hold on! Oh. Police officers get a call about something suspicious happening at a park nearby. Listen your hands! They hear some shady characters hanging around the ball field, and naturally they take it seriously. But instead of finding troublemakers, they've met with something completely unexpected. A bunch of kids bundled up and ready for a snowball fight. Here is another hilarious story that'll make you laugh. Officer Kelly Dunn was out recording a video, braving the harsh winter weather conditions to keep everyone safe. Little did she know, another officer was secretly plotting a prank. Some kids were playing basketball a bit too loudly, and someone ended up calling the cops on them. I don't know who called, but obviously, I ain't got no problem with it. Hey, that's a nice hoop. You guys play out here every day? Yeah. I might bring some backup. You gonna be out here tomorrow? The officer surprised everyone by saying, Obviously, I ain't got no problem with this. You are not going to believe what the cop had in mind. It's not every day that you get to play ball with an NBA legend, but thanks to the officer's playful spirit and Shaq's big heart, those kids have a memory that'll stick with them forever. Here is a story that's as cute as it is unexpected. This young adult was speeding down the road, desperate to make it on time for his big presentation. When the police pulled him over, you won't believe what happened next. Being stoned by 29. How's it going? Good, how are you? Good. Who's gonna stop you for your speed going down 8th Street? 8th Street, uh, Cap. He Cap. turned off a 13th Ave yeah, and then I he know. went... I told you, yep, I know what you mean. After I get a tie tied and have a presentation and thought my buddy was home but he's not and I'm running behind ice. Okay, so, yeah, I was wondering why you looped down yeah, 8th Street and then yeah, back up Yeah, because that house that's one of my good friends' house and knows how to tie ties and I honestly don't know how to. Where's your tie? There it is. While I do this, why don't you grab your proof of insurance and your driver's license quick? Yes, sir. There, you should be able to adjust it. Okay, thank you so much.
Probably not the best now, but it'll work. Yeah, it'll work. A lot better than what I was going to do, that's for <laughs> sure. Thank you so Last much. Name is for your insurance? Yep. Oh, it does have the car in there. Never mind. Yep. That's okay. And that one expired in oh, May, sure. so make sure you get a new one yeah, in there. Yeah, I have yeah, mom and dad. Okay, yeah, I'm actually going home right after class, after uh, the presentation. Hey, you're... I gotta tie it shorter here. Okay. It's kind of hard with all this crap on. Yeah, it's not a big deal. I can have something <laughs> in class here, too. Yeah, I kind of thought I was going to get dinged up when you were behind me. <laughs> well, I was going to stop you sooner, but then that blazer pulled out between us. Yeah, well, I thought you were going to get me there, then. But Try that. There's only a little bit of a tail there, so. Okay. Well, it's almost too long, but. I'm going to have this jacket on, so. Looks good. Thank you. All right, man. Slow down. Yep, yeah, we'll do it. Two cops pull up to a woman's house. Hello, how are you? Good, how are you? Oh, Jesus. The craziest thing you're not going to believe. What happened? Were you with like a hairstylist? No. So there's like hair hanging out of your thumb? Oh my Jesus. Someone's like... Oh, that's my weave. Oh, hold on. That's part of my wig. Hold on. And when she opens the door, her worry is pretty obvious in her voice. This guy couldn't contain himself. The next video is guaranteed to stay with you for a while. I got pulled over by a police officer again. And you will not believe what happens next. License, registration, and insurance, please. <laughs> Dad, we've been through this. You can't just pull me over because you see my car on the road. This woman gets pulled over by a police officer and decides to recall the whole encounter. At first, you might think she's capturing it for a serious reason. But when you hear the full story, you'll be laughing in no time. I was just making sure you're okay. <laughs> Here we have a family having a lively party at their house. But the noise caught the attention of the neighbors, who called in a complaint. Their house. And this police officer Hello? showed up after someone called in a noise complaint. But what unfolded next surprised everyone. When the cops arrived, their body language was pretty stern and aggressive. You might expect a routine warning or maybe a request for everyone to quiet down. Good for the cop for trying to have a little fun while on duty. A group of friends found themselves pulled over by the police. And when the officer asked if they knew why they were being stopped. Pulled you over today? No clue, man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, so, I'm sorry. Three? You have anything to drink today? No. No, nah, we you don't drink. We're Muslims, drink. bro. One of the guys couldn't help but burst into laughter. Sometimes, a bit of humor can make even the most mundane situations a lot more enjoyable. <laughs> but they didn't realize they broke a traffic law. If you want to take a breathalyzer, it's fine. No, I'm I'm done. You want to take it? People don't normally think it's this funny when they get stopped by law enforcement. No, this guy, he's just been laughing all <laughs> day. I'm so sorry. <laughs> the reason why I stopped you is because you're going 46 through town there. It's only 35 miles an hour there. This video is an absolute jam of comedy. But his delivery driver got pulled over by Chicago police. Hey bro, can I get my pizza, bro? Overwhelmed by hunger, he decided to investigate. Hey, can I get my pizza first, officers? Isn't that like 30 minutes of free though? Huh? 30 minutes of free, right? Bro, y'all just pulled over the pizza, man. He doing his job. But the officer explained that the driver ran a stop sign. So this guy ordered a pizza, but just as the delivery guy is about to drop it off, he gets pulled over by the cops. Alright, I just want my pizza, I'm starving. It's your pizza, bro. Alright, I love you. I love you too, Alright. Some people really lean into that whole cops love donuts stereotype, and this guy took it to the next level. Who knew a donut could get you out of a ticket? Good morning, sir. Hi, uh, good morning. You, it's okay if I film you, sir. I, I'm just kind of nervous around the police officers. No, sir, that's, that's quite all right. The reason I'm stopping you is for speeding, sir. No, sir. Okay. Were you aware you're going that fast? No, sir, I didn't. Now, let me ask you something, yes, sir. officer. Did, are you aware that today's National Donut Day? I'm sorry, sir? Did you, are you aware it's National Donut Day? No, sir, I'm not. Yes, sir, today is National Donut Day. Awesome. Yeah. Great. So. 
Is there now, anything so you, we can do? Warning, anything, sir? No, sir. No, no. sir. We uh, we strictly enforce the speeding rules out here. Yes, sir. Uh, I understand. May I see your license, please? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. No problem. Hang on just one second. There you go, sir. Will this work for you? I can't seem to find my license, but... You have a good day, sir. Thank you, officer. I appreciate it very much. Have a good day. A 57-year-old man was cruising down one of the main roads, doing a wheelie like he was still in his 20s. When the police officer pulled him over, he was in for a surprise. I'm screwed. How big a ticket is this going to be? Hi. Good morning, officer. How are you doing? Good, how are you? Pretty good. What, what, you have any idea why I stopped you? Um, yeah, uh, yeah I got an idea. 1400 block of Harrison Street. Uh, I got a pretty good idea. I really expected to see a guy that was about 22. How old are you? Uh, uh 57. 57. Oh, yeah. You got your driver's license? I sure do. All right. All right, hang tight, man. Okay. It's just a written warning, okay? This goes into the damn court system. It doesn't go into the state, apparently. Okay? Five years older than I am. I really expect to see a 22-year-old kid. I'm sorry. <laughs> not a big, not a big deal, okay? That is just insane. Seriously, you won't believe what this guy did when he got stopped by a cop. The cop pulls him over and asks for ID. This auditor hands over a reverse card when the police officer asks for his identification card. Billy Buttcrack from the Billy Buttcrack News Network. Okay. I need your actual ID, sir. Oh. Sir, let me see that ID, please. Right. I'm trying to go to the lactation plant. If you want to help with the missing person report. What missing person report? I've been looking for this man. I've been looking all over for him. He goes by Beetle. Beetlejuice Lester Green is his real name. Okay. Hang tight. I'll be right back with you. Okay. Now, you can tell the cop is already expecting something weird by the look on his face. The whole situation is so over-the-top ridiculous that it's hard not to laugh. This biker and his buddy were speeding down a main road, probably enjoying the ride a bit too much when suddenly, they saw those flashing lights behind them. y'all got up to? Uh, we rolled at 30. And then we stopped at about, I'd say 65. So we, because we saw you, honestly. I got you locked at 84. Uh, you, you may think you stopped at 65, but you got, you, I got you at 84, both of them. You want me to take my helmet off? Second is going to be 159 Zulu Charlie 2. See your license. You, you want me to take my helmet off or? Okay, I'm in the back pocket. <clears throat> Younger man, you can go and get your license out, walk back here to me. You got a weapon on you? If I can get it out here, whoops. Here you go. Yeah, yeah, you need to see that. It's in my back back seat here. First 27 is going to be Tennessee. Next one's going to be Tennessee. So how fast y'all think I got up there? I think honestly, I'll be real honest with you. I think 65, and then I saw you shit my pants and then hit the brakes. <laughs> yeah. Uh, believe it or not, no. <laughs> and I've been riding for two years. Better not be off. Well, but mine's dead on. Yeah. Mine's within two. Yeah. So, gentlemen, this is not the place to be trying. Yes, sir. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that's. You know, yeah, you see a break in traffic, you're like. Well, I understand. I used to own one. Yeah. I had a one thousand. I loved it to death. Yeah. Been there, done it, done what y'all did, and been stupid about it. Yeah. Got rid of mine because I just couldn't. Everybody around me saw somebody was going to kill him. Yeah, that's that's true. I'm, Somebody's gonna be hopefully not scraping you up and calling your family. 
Alright, as long as you ain't got no warrants, I'm gonna cut you with a warrant, Jim. Alright, appreciate it. This might just be the sweetest thing you'll see today. A young boy had been hustling, trying to earn some extra cash by doing yard work. Impressed by how respectful and honest the kid was, Officer Colloran decided to buy the kid the game console he wanted. Also, he could save up for a PlayStation. But then the unexpected happened. A complaint was made and a cop was called to check things out. Now, this guy was simply being nice to the cop by waving at him. The cop misunderstands him. See what happens next. Hey, how you doing, buddy? Good. Were you trying to flag me down? No, I was just waving at you. I just, okay. I'm, I'm always friendly with police, so I just always wave them, high five them and stuff. And gotcha. Just, well, when I see someone out on the road, no, I, just, I know if there's a wreck. No, I'm sorry. Like, no, I was just waving to you, man. I'm just always friendly with cops, man. Gotcha. All right, no problem. Like, I just want to make sure it wasn't. No, man, hey, I appreciate that, man. Oh, uh, yeah, sorry, right. I, your cops don't usually shake hands. <laughs> no My dad told me that, and I still do it. <laughs> yeah. Hey, um, because I have stopped you, I at least got documents to stop. Do you have your driver's license on you there? I do. All right, so uh, I haven't, okay. so I didn't break the law or anything, right? No, uh -huh. okay. No, I just want to make sure it was no, no issue. Because, like I said, if someone flags me down, I just want to make sure it wasn't. Uh, I've had people, pedestrians hit before, I've had wrecks. Right, right, right. So. As this biker was approaching a spotlight, he found himself right next to a cop. What happened next is the coolest thing ever. Of course. <laughs> you think I wouldn't pull over? I got a license plate on this one. <laughs> I mean, I got nothing to, to stop for, you know. Thanks, man. <laughs> If I do a wheelie, you're going to pull me over? No? You're the nicest sheriff I ever met, bro. <laughs> so which one is your favorite? Let us know in the comments below. Subscribe to our channel for more content like this. See you in the next one.